the basic question is why am I posting about these random places in Germany which nobody really knows about? So here's the thing guys, if you go through any company's travel plan through Europe, you'll find visit to Cuckoo Clock is included in almost every travel plan. Cuckoo clocks were invented in the Black Forest area of Germany. Now Black Forest is a huge area, within that area also there are 2-3 places which are famous for cuckoo clocks. Namely, first it's uh, called Titisi and other is called Treeburg. So last month I visited this shop which is called House of Thousand Cuckoo Clocks in Treeburg, Germany. So in this video I'll be taking you guys to the most stunning and of course expensive cuckoo clocks of Germany. And guys, as soon as I entered the city, I could spot this huge shop with exterior built as a working cuckoo clock. So you simply cannot miss it. So once we entered the shop, we got all curious and we asked one salesperson how does the clock work and what he answered was this. So then I asked him, Konen Sie ein bisschen English? Can you speak a little bit of English? And he replied like this. Yeah. Yeah. And mine. <laughs> Your wife speaks perfectly German. Uh, she asked me to speak English. Sie learned Deutsch. Yeah, she learned Deutsch. Selling Techniques 101? Dude, I get that. I've been teacher to that class. Jokes apart, he was very helpful. He showed me around almost for half a day and handled crazy person like me. So thanks to him, if you're watching my video, please subscribe to my channel. Not just him. Maybe you all please subscribe to my channel. Half hour, one time. Okay, half hour, one time. Uh-huh. And then three hours, three times, and so on. Guys, I could be here like for entire day. Look at these watches. And every uh, watch has different theme, so literally you can spend like entire day over here. They are entirely handmade and they are totally mechanical. Even the sound of cuckoo is produced by diaphragm. So this is the world's most exclusive cuckoo clock, which they claim. I don't know about it, but they claim it. And they say that they have 617 Swarovski stein or stones in this clock. And yeah, they have 24 karat black gold. I don't know what it is. <laughs> Beaten gold. <laughs> Beaten. And this clock took 215 hours to make it. It's a totally handmade clock. And this one is with the Black Forest theme. So this hat over here is typical Black Forest hat. Treeburg is a beautiful city by itself. There are so many traditional things to experience around. For example, you can experience how the real Black Forest cake tastes like, which by the way originates from this place. You get to see traditional Black Forest clothing. You can try their amazing Black Forest hat. 
this is typical black forest cap so i'm trying one see the rock yes <laughs> On our way back, this group of sweet ladies doing bachelorette party or hen's party found us. The way they celebrate bachelorette party here, or I just know it's just over here or everywhere, it was totally new for me. So bride had so many things to sell. You just buy some things from her and give them money. So eventually they go to the bar and have a party. So we have some sweet things. We have alcohol. We have socks. <laughs> it was very cold, you know. Like this is very cold. This also for very cold. This alcohol. Lucky, lucky, lucky pick. Lucky pick, and you can put some some coins in. And then you go to bank and say, so I have now a lot of money. <laughs> okay, okay. Thank you. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Have a good time. Yeah, same to you. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Bye. I'm actually filming this on a bus stop. I'm waiting for my bus back home. Hopefully, we'll be here soon. I enjoyed a lot. Next week, I'll be posting new travel story from new destination. So be sure you subscribe to my channel, turn that notification button on, and let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. So see you in the next one. Bye.